गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स Very very important one of this field 
micro propagation micro propagation means through this is the plant tissue culture we can produce in a large number of the plants understood ma so these are the two artificial methods of reproduction both the artificial methods means first one is conventional method and another one is modern method understood next one the conventional method of the conventional methods of very good that's the propagation conventional methods means already i said that is the very very oldest method that is the agricultural and that is the agricultural field they are using in this is the method is very very oldest one of the type so they are comes on the in that is the three types of one. one is cutting grafting and layering what are the three methods of conventional methods in that cutting grafting and layering clear so these are the three conventional methods of reproduction so they comes these three categories first one cutting so what do you mean by cutting i i mean what is the reproduction style so they comes under it that is the cutting cutting means simply we can cutting the plant part suppose the cutting the plant parts means either that is the root stem or leaf so these are the plant parts they cut it and then just we are inserted and then just we are placed in the this is suitable medium after that that can produce us in that is the root clear so the root and then finally that is the growing in that is the new plant this is the one of the ordinary method of this cutting understood children right? the conventional method mainly they comes in a three types of right? one is cutting grafting and layering clear these are the three methods this three methods first method is the cutting cutting means simply if any one of this plant part either that is the root or that is a leaf or that is a stem we can cut it and then plant it in that is a suitable one of this medium so from there that is they produce us in a root and they growing in that is the plant so that is the new plant development so that is we are called as the method is cutting so this cutting is they comes to three types root cutting so from the root part we are cutted and growing in that is a new plant root cutting and then from that is the stem region they cut out and they growing in that part so that is known as a stem cutting and then so there is the leaf cutting clear so these are the three types of cutting methods first one root cutting that's a good one of the example of the species is mollus and then the next one the stem cutting so there is a familiar of this two specimens in red corners i discuss and bohemilla moringa rose so these are the plants so they familiar to there is the cutting of the stem region they produce in a roots and they growing in a new plant understood children then next one leaf cutting leaf cutting means from that region so the leaf so they developing that roots and they arise in that is the new plant so that is a good example is the bryophylla and begonia species understood ma the next one is grafting the grafting so here this is the conventional method of the second type of this grafting very very the two parts joining of this two different parts we can join it that is the method is called grafting clear suppose if we need to there is a cutting of this two varieties of the species so we can produce in a one single plant means so that time we will use this a grafting method understood ma two different varieties suppose for example mango tree the mango tree two different varieties of the mangoes so we can joining in that is the or we can producing in this is the grafting method joining of this two different plant species clear this is the two different plant species join and they produce us in one of this new plant clear children so here we can use this is the two different part the first one 
these two different part so that is the name is they are giving one is stalk and another one is sia what do you mean by stalk means so the plants are they contact with the soil that's the specimen that's a plant as we are called as the name is known as stalk clear then sia sia means which part of the plant we can use it for the grafting that is we are called the sia understood ma the first one they contact with the soil that is we are called the stalk the next one sia so there is used for the grafting that's known as sia understood children say some so here for this is the method we can using they produce a set that is the so many different varieties of the plant species there right? such as the examples for the is mango tree citrus plant apple okay so these are the certain examples of the plants the first one what are the different methods of so we are going to learn about this is the different method of different types of grafting clear first one what do you mean by grafting grafting means joining of this two different plants varieties they grow in a finally that is growing in a one of the new species clear new plant so at that time we will take that cell two part one as stalk and another one as cian what do you mean by cian children very good the grafting purpose we are using the plant that is the part is called the very good that's the part of the plant is called the sia stalk means ah uh, very good so that is contact with the soil okay that is we are that's the plant is contact with the soil that plant is we are called as the name is known as stalk understood the next one is we are going to learn about this is one of the five mark question children listen carefully different types of grafting okay so there is a different types of grafting the grafting so they comes on the right five types you right first one is bud grafting approach grafting trunk grafting crown grafting wedge grafting what are the five methods of grafting you right bud grafting approach grafting trunk grafting crown grafting wedge grafting okay let us see one by one first one bud grafting bud grafting means first one we can using the stalk okay already i said what do you mean by stalk you know that that only stalk first we can selecting this is the stalk and in the stalk region in the stalk of this plant the cut is they made in a t shaped okay so this is the t shaped cut is they made it in the this is a okay that region just you lifted that is the bark understood ma'am then after that the sion is the bud okay the from the other plant we will select that sub bud this bud is inserted into that the t shape of the sion clear so this is the bud is they selected from the another plant so that bud that's the bud is a sion we are selecting in the sion that one is inserted in that's a t portion we already bark is removed now that insertion that's a cut area inserted this is the bud of the sion and then finally we can tie it and then we can lay it okay so this type of the grafting is we are called as the name is known as bud grafting the first method of grafting that's the bud grafting okay next one approach grafting okay the next one is we are called that's a approach grafting so in this method clear this is the method the sian and stalk is the both the things are the rooted only i mean first one the sian and stalk i mean first this is the sian this is the stalk so first these two are they rooted in the soil clear first one this two items so this two items we can place it in that very close the stalk is grow 
going on this quarter divided chain. Okay, we can the choosing that is the star that type of the plant is we can very good selected in a parted plant. The cyan will be okay. That's a cyan sir very closely to comes to that. Then after what we can do in this two plants means slightly the small cutters they form in that the cyan and the stalk. Okay, slightly we can cut out. This is the two parts, right? The two part of the plants. That's a yeah, cyan and also very good. So there is a stalk. Clear? Yeah? So these two areas slightly cut it. I mean, so that's the outer region of the bark is literally little remove it and then finally very closely to keep and then finally we can tie this two type of the plants. See on and that stop. Understood ma? Then if it's tying after that four week, okay? So one to four week. The tip of this stalk, okay, the tip of the stalk, and then so this is the base of the cyan. I mean, so this is the potted plant. So the tip of this this region, and then base of the stalk region. Clear? So this region, if you are cutted and they growing in that is the new plant. Understood? No? Say yes or no? So just if you are. Selecting that is the area, so that is the tip of the cyan and tip of the stalk and then base of the cyan, just cut it and separated in a growing in that is the very good growing in that is the separated potted plants. Understood, ma? Say yes or no? Yes. Next one, tongue grafting. Okay, the next one of the grafting is the tongue grafting. Tongue grafting means. So here, cyan and the stalk, these both are having in a same thickness. We can selecting in the set tongue grafting. If we select the cyan and the stalk, both the parts of the plants are selecting in a same thickness. Clear pa? This same thickness we can cut out in a slanting manner. So these also cut it in a same manner and this is the stalk also they cut it in a same manner. I mean slight slanting voice only we can cut then finally we can tie it in a proper way. Understood ma? So this, this is the method we are called as the name is known as tongue crafting. Not only this is the two items. The position is cutted in different ways, not to suit for these two items. Okay, so that's why the sia and the stalk we can cut slanting manner, then finally place it in that together and tie it. So this is the method as we are called as the name is known as tongue crafting. Clear children? Next one, crown crafting or clift crafting. Okay. Crown grafting or cliff grafting. If the stalk is very low just size, okay? The stalk means we can select in this step. Stalk is very low just size, children. Right? But that's a CR we can select and we can take it in a wet sheet, okay? The wet sheet cut only, we can make it in that is a CR. This wet shaped cut that is inserted into the, the large size of this sia, sorry, stalk range. Yeah? Inserted in these two, finally we can use it in the graft wax. Graft wax means one that type of the one special wax is we can use it to joining of these two parts. Understood ma? Say yes or no children? So this is the grafting as we are called as the name is known as crown grafting. Okay. So this is the method is called a crown grafting. The next one wedge grafting. Okay. So the next one is wedge grafting. 
What do you mean by vertical grafting? What's the method of this vertical grafting means? First one, the slit is made in the stock region. Okay, the zone of the slit or the zone of the small hole, like the splitting is, they made it in that is the Sion region. And then this is the stock that can removing in that is the bulk. Okay, so that's say if we are choosing in the stock, that stock region we can lifting that is the are removing that is the bulk. Then the sion is inserted into that is tightly of this. The, the touching of this, the cambium cells of this two regions. I mean, so there is a sion and that is the stop. So these two are joining and then finally we can type that. Clear to that? First one, we can made it in that is the this is the stock region. We can made it in a slit children. Then finally, this is the bulb also, or that's just removing that is the bar. Then this is the CM so inserted they very tightly, and then there's a two cambium regions so of joint. Okay, so this is the two cambium regions so of joint. Then finally, we will select or we will get it in a one of this new plant items. Okay, so these are the propagation method, these are the reproduction methods of this, that's a different type of the grafting methods. Understood no? Say yes or no? What are the different types of the grafting? So there is comes on the bud grafting, approach grafting, tongue grafting, crown grafting and wedge grafting. So these are the five methods of the grafting. They comes to that is the very good the plants were they producing in a conventional method of the second type grafting. Understood now? So these all the things we need to prepare that's one of the five mark questions. Understood? So today I am going to give this is the some of the two mark questions and five mark questions children. First one all should prepare what is the conventional method and second one what is the modern method. Clear? The next one so the conventional method is they comes under in three types of right? First one is cutting, grafting and layering. Then what is cutting? Then from where is the plant spots we are using in that so cutting? Next one grafting. Grafting so these are the two items, two different part we are selecting and joining the plants. That's the method is known as grafting. We can use it in the stock and cyan. Cyan means what and stock means what. Okay. Next one, learn about this a five mark question. Different types of grafting. So then we can learn these five types. Right? So this is the diagram so also very very important for this five mark question. Understood? No? This is the different types representing that's the grafting. That is the very very important one thing. You need to prepare along with this types of grafting. Clear? So I am going to give this is one of the homework question children. So all should prepare this is one of the five mark question different explained types of grafting or explain different methods of grafting. Understood? Three mark question what is conventional method? What is modern method? Then write notes on cutting. Clear children? So these are the questions. So I should prepare it. And then one class work work. You can select that is one of this keep one of this botany class work note. There all should draw this is the diagram. Different types of grafting. Okay. Shall we draw? Yes, very good. Thank you students.